Happy Tuesday, everybody. It's uh, almost 7 o'clock here. Time for me to go on my run. It's still pretty dark out, as you can see. But it's a another recovery run today, only like 12 minutes. I'm not a huge fan of only running for 12 minutes, but I'm sticking to this marathon plan that I downloaded. I know the recovery days are important. So head out and then I'll probably come back and definitely do some workouts after since the run is so short. But uh, see you there on the road. Got about four minutes left in the run. Been taking it super chill. I'm just up here on our ball fields, running on the nice flat grass. Thanks for being flat grass. Back from the run, time to stretch, workout, shower, eat some breakfast. Gonna be good. Oh, Tyler's getting into work on his truck. There he goes, ready to cook up some delicious food. Just finished reading Matthew chapter seven. I think my takeaway from this chapter would be from uh, verse 24 through 28 when it's talking about the wise and foolish builders, talking about how the wise man is someone who takes what he learns, what Jesus taught, and uh, sets it into practice and lives that out. And it's like a man who builds his house on the rock and it stays firm. Um, and then the foolish man hears all these things but then doesn't put them into practice. and. It's like building this house on sand and it falls apart. So I also make sure in my life that I'm actually putting what I learned into practice and, hey, look, it's Emily, and having a good foundation in my faith. Thanks, Matthew 7. Emily's looking good today. About to dig into this breakfast. Let's go. All done at home and I'm headed up to work. I got a cutie for the road. I uh, ended up doing a little ab workout and then got a nice shower and headed to my office now. Here's a view of campus looking very nice this morning. Wow. Good job, camp. But gonna head to the office and get prepped for the game again to play with the DFACS group. Um, well, well, yesterday. Hopefully, it goes well again today. Other than doing that, my big task for the day is starting to read and evaluate our rookie applications for summer 2023. They opened up on October 1st, so they've been pouring in. I've got to read all the applications and give feedback on all of those. So that'll probably take up the rest of my day outside prepping and playing the game with the group. So I'm going to be reading a lot of uh, words today. Hey, hanging backstage here in the chapel. I don't think I've shown the chapel, the inside of the vlog yet. So here's the backstage area. This is where in the summer we have all of our prep for all of our skits and things like that. Keep a lot of the costumes down here. But I am just here working on separating out these pun intended cards again. So we'll be ready to play that. Oh, Cole's playing some music. I'll take you outside. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba. Here's the outside view from the chapel. We've got some lovely couches on to sit over here. And down there in the courtyard, we have Scott. It's a bright blue jacket. It looks it. Scott. Just finished up with the game and headed back down to the dining hall to get some lunch. I totally forgot to ask anyone to get any footage of me, so. Sorry vlog, no clips of me on stage leading the game, but I think it went even better today. The group was having a lot of laughs, had some fun, so it was a good time running the games for them. Lunch time. Hey, we at home, eating some more soup from yesterday. It's a great time, Emily's working on her master's homework. I'm chilling on the couch, about to turn on the Braves. Hopefully they take the uh, Annalise tonight. Am any words for the vlog? That's my word. Yeah. All right. Thanks for watching. See ya tomorrow. Ah.